Well, the Rowlett Fire Department expects to be here at the VIEW Apartments here in Rowlett over the next five to six days to manage any hot spots, any flare-ups. The fire chief reminds us that a fire can double in size every minute. Wind-driven fires are very dangerous. The fire that started Friday night Crews continue to fight into Monday. No flames, but certainly smoke. Hot spots that are laying there that will go out and reignite over time. These luxury apartments on Sapphire Bay along Lake Ray Hubbard is not the view developers were going for. They can't seem to knock it out. The whole top part's pretty much demolished. Mark Tarani and his girlfriend live in the properties next door. They've been dealing with four days of the smoke. Getting in and out has been hard. Now their car is parked a ways from their home. People asking for my license, that's probably the most annoying part. Nobody nearby has been evacuated, but crews here for work and deliveries are waiting to see how and when this fire finally tames. We're down here where we catch a lot of wind. There's no wind break, so it's blowing right into the structure. Fighting not just the fire, but the elements too. Rowlett fire crews have been rotating in. The good news is nobody was inside and nobody is hurt. Zale Properties tells us they were hoping to open doors in mid-January for leases. That will have to wait. Four days in and there have been battles, but no question who wins this war. We're going to be here and we're going to make sure we mitigate this incident until it's completely done. In Rowlett, 